Good morning and welcome to the Wellesley Free Library, Fells Branch. It's now open from 10 until 5, Tuesday through Friday, so perhaps I'll see you here. Let's begin with our gathering song. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. For your friends are my friends, and my friends are your friends. Oh, the more we get together, the happier we'll be. I'm Ms. Lee, and when you fingerspell my name, it looks like this, L. E E. So today's story time is going to be a surprise. And let's see if we can find Luella May. Luella May, she's run away. By Karen Beaumont Alarcon, with illustrations by Roseanne Litzenzinger. Luella May, she's run away. Look in the cornfields, look in the hay. Where, oh where, is Luella May? Fetch the old hound dog, fetch all your kin. Luella May's run away again. She's not in the cornfields, she's not in the hay. Where, oh where, is Luella May? Round up the horses, hitch up the team, hop in the buckboard and look by the stream. Has anyone seen her? Now where could she be? Go look in the hollowed out trunk of that tree. Set down your washboards, your needles, and yarn, and see if she's hiding out there in the barn. She's not by the stream, nor the barn, nor the tree. Where, oh, where could Luella may be? In the woods, there's a shadow. Go look over there before she gets swallowed up by a big old black bear. Did somebody snatch her? A banshee or witch? Or did she get caught by the vines by the ditch? Run tell the neighbors and y'all give a yell for she wanders off yonder and falls in the well. Has anyone seen her? Does anyone know? Where, oh, where did Luella May go? Look, is that her? Is she lost on the ridge? Or could she be stuck in the muck neath the bridge? We've looked, we can't find her, not here and not there. Is she this way or that way or which way? Or where? Night falls coming. Oh mercy, I swan, it looks like Luella May's really gone. Hey Ma, go tell Pa, Uncle Henry and Chubb, we found her. She's sleeping inside the tub. So now you know the star of our story time today. Why are pigs not allowed to play soccer? Because they hog the ball. Now let's do a song in which we will spell piggy and then 
Every time we sing it, each verse, we will eliminate one letter and say oink. Okay? Let's give it a try. There was a farmer had a pig, and piggy was her name, oh, P-I-G-G-Y, 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 and piggy was her name, oh. Here we go. There was a farmer had a pig and piggy was her name o oink i g g y oink i g g y oink i g g y and piggy was her name o There was a farmer had a pig and piggy was her name o oink oink g g y Oink, oink, G-G-Y, oink, oink, G-G-Y, and Piggy was her name -o. How are we doing? There was a farmer had a pig, and Piggy was her name -o. Oink, 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 G-Y, oink, 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 G-Y, oink, 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 G-Y. And Piggy was her name -o. There was a farmer had a pig, and Piggy was her name -o. Oink, 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 why? Oink, 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 why? Oink, 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 why? And Piggy was her name -o. All right. There, <laughs> there was a farmer had a pig and piggy was her name oh oink 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 and piggy was her name oh oink. Now let's look at Luella May's piglets, some real pigs. Watch animals grow. Piglets by Colleen Sexton. A mother pig has piglets. Newborn piglets are very small. Piglets stay close to their mother. They live together on a farm. Piglets drink milk from their mother. Milk helps them grow strong. Soon farmers start to feed piglets grain. A piglet has a snout. A piglet uses its snout to sniff the ground for food. Piglets play. Sometimes they chase and bite each other playfully. Piglets roll in the mud to keep cool. Piglets sleep most of the time. Sleeping helps them grow. Piglets grow up fast. Soon they may have piglets of their own. Why do pigs like mud? Well, pigs don't have any sweat glands like we do. So they need to cool off in the mud. The other reason is that, like us, pigs get sunburned. So if they coat their bodies with some mud, they won't get a sunburn. 
Now let's do the Higgy Piggy. It's like the Hokey Pokey, which is changing a few words. Are you ready? You put your right hoof in, you take your right hoof out, you put your right hoof in and you shake it all about. You do the Higgy Piggy and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your left hoof in, you take your left hoof out, you put your left hoof in and you shake it all about. You do the Higgy Piggy and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your right ham hock in, you take your right ham hock out, you put your right ham hock in and you shake it all about. <laughs> you do the higgy piggy and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your left ham hock in, you take your left ham hock out, you put your left ham hock in and you shake it all about. You do the higgy piggy and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your snout in, you take your snout out, you put your snout in and you shake it all about. You do the higgy piggy and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your tail in, you take your tail out, you put your tail in and you shake it all about. You do the higgy piggy and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your whole self in, you take your whole self out, you put your whole self in and you shake it all about. You do the higgy piggy and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Now, let's take a look at a book where the pigs are trying to help. Pigs to the Rescue by John Himmelman. For Carol, who wants to help animals. On Monday, the tractor broke down. Farmer Greenstalk couldn't plow his fields. Pigs to the rescue! Um, thank you, I think, said Farmer Greenstalk. On Tuesday, Mrs. Greenstalk found a leak in her garden hose. Pigs to the rescue! You really didn't have to do that, said Mrs. Greenstalk, but thanks. On Wednesday, Jeffrey Greenstalk got his kite stuck in a tree. Pigs to the rescue! Well, you did get it out of the tree, I guess, said Jeffrey. On Thursday morning, Caleb the rooster had a sore throat and couldn't crow. Pigs to the rescue! Squeal! Snort! Oink, oink! Squeal! Oink, oink! We're awake, we're awake, shouted Farmer Greenstalk. On Friday, 
Emily Greenstock broke the lace on her shoe. Pigs to the rescue! Oops, said Emily. On Saturday, Ernie the Duck was sad because no one remembered his birthday. Pigs to the rescue! Quack, said Ernie the Duck. On Sunday, Lulu the cat tipped over her saucer of milk. The green stalks ran into the room. Shh, they said, don't let the pigs know. Everyone froze and listened. That was close, said Mrs. Greenstalk. Thank goodness the pigs didn't find out about this one. What kind of truck do farmers take their pigs to market in? A pig-up truck. Not a pick-up truck, but a pig-up truck. See you later, alligator, in a wild crocodile. Give a hug, ladybug, blow a kiss, jellyfish. See you soon, big baboon. Out the door, dinosaur. Take care, polar bear. Wave goodbye, butterfly. See you next time.